Howdy. Hello, and welcome to the Taste Taste Test, Test. where we test foods that you normally can't get uh, because they're in test markets. I'm your host, Doughboy Dad, and with me I have... Flubu the Third. Howdy. Today we're at KFC in the Pittsburgh area trying a new item that they have on the test market called the Smashed Bowls. You can see right here that has um, uh, French fries, mashed potatoes, a cheese sauce, a three cheese blend, and bacon. So it's kind of like mostly, you know, it's two kinds of potatoes and three and four kinds of cheese, mostly potatoes and cheese. Let's, yeah. This is not your normal review show. What we're going to do is we're going to have a taste test. Flibu the Third is a self-professed expert on KFC, and I'm going to uh, uh, quiz him on KFC. I'm going to quiz him on KFC trivia, and if he gets it right, he gets to try the food. You ready, Flibu? Yeah. All right. Here's your first question. In what year did Colonel Sanders first make his secret recipe fried chicken as we know it today? It was A, 1930, B, 1939, C, 1952, or D, 2024? 52. No, that is incorrect. Oh. It was 1939. May I have uh, the... Uh, the bowl here. Oh, goodness. Because he got it wrong, I get to try it. Oh. Mashed potatoes, french fries, bacon, cheese and cheese. Mmm. Wow. That's good. Let me hold on to that for now. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Second question. What unique method did Colonel Sanders use to make his chicken? It was A, a pressure fryer, B, double frying, C, using unique frying oils, or D, spinning the chickens around until they were dizzy? Pressure cooker. A pressure fryer, that's correct. Now you get to have your first bite of the... All right, let's see here. All right, I want to get a good... Yeah, get a good bite there with cheese and fries and bacon potatoes now normally oh. it doesn't come with chicken that is very very good oh no second bites until oh. the next question I'll give you that one because the first one was small okay. but on this for if, if one of us gets to try the second bite we're gonna try the one with chicken in it because you can get it for extra two dollars or something like that get it with chicken so here's a third question okay that's very good the potatoes are mm -hmm. Somehow the fries are still crispy, which I'm I'm amazed. That's, yeah, that's actually that's actually really good. Because usually they get soggy under under potatoes. Okay. Oh, yeah. So here's question number three. You can try the one with chicken in it now, if you get this right. Right. Where was the first KFC franchise opened in 1952? Was it A. Kentucky, B. Utah, C. New York, or D. Leningrad? It was in Utah. That's right. Now try the one with chicken. All right. Oh, that that actually looks pretty good. I don't think it has. I don't think it has a bake. Oh yeah, it does have the bacon on it. You just can't see it very well. Yep. So you can take a bite of chicken. Yeah, I want to get a good bite, good bite of chicken in there. With the bacon too. Oh yeah. Ooh. So you got two out of the three right. Mmm. What do you think? Is it good with the chicken? 100% better with the chicken. Yeah. Okay. So question number four. Where is the head office of KFC today? Is it A, Lexington, Kentucky? B, Bowling Green, Kentucky? C, Louisville, Kentucky? Or D, Extra Crispy, Kentucky? Um, could you list the Lexington? It was Bowling Green and... Louisville. It's the third. And then there's extra crispy Kentucky. I yeah. think, I think, I'm gonna go with Louisville. You are correct. Yay! You get to try any either one. I want to go back. I want to go back to the original. Yeah. I want to go back to the original, just to like. Yep. Take one more bite. Uh -huh. Then we have one last question, and you'll see if you get that last bite or if I do. Mm -hmm. And of course, 
I'll still try with the one with the chicken. Okay, now I'm going is... back. The mashed potatoes are a bit less flavorful than I would have expected. It's KFC mashed potatoes. I don't mm -hmm. think they usually they usually have a gla uh, gravy. Yeah. Gravy with them, so when you usually get them. Hey, final question on this taste test. Question number five. What is the single largest market for a KFC? Is it A, the United States? B, Japan? C, China? Or D, the Vatican? Japan. No, it is China. Over the recent years, since uh, over the over recent years, KFC has multiplied and multiplied in China, till it's their biggest market right now. All right, give me the one with the chicken if you don't mind. I'm gonna try that myself. See how that tastes. Get a little bit of chicken here. Oh, these nuggets are big. Yeah. Chicken. Get a little French fries. Get a little cheese. Get some bacon. Oh man, so much going on here. Oh yeah. Okay. Here we go. I think I got a good bite here. Mmm. The chicken adds a lot. So now, we're going to give these our final rating. Okay, uh, so Flibby the Third, the bowl without the chicken. On a scale of one to five, what would you what would you give that? So, Honestly, actually, I'm going to give one more bite before you do that. Yeah, can I eat it again or no? Yeah. Okay. So, it's good. The fries are crispy. The cheese is yummy. And I think it's a good dish as a whole. I'll rate it a, 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 a 3.5. Oh. Does it have to be whole numbers? Yes, if you please. I'll rate it a 4. I would give it a 3 because... You know, the chicken is the extra part of it. Um, and I think it's great as a side, in a way. They yeah. sell it as a combo where you get a drink. To me, it's, like, not enough to be its own thing. It's a, it's kind of a big side, sure. But it, but by itself, it's not enough. You really need the chicken. Which I, I'm going to, you know, I think it's the makes it so much better. You get the, you know, yeah. the KFC's uh, Can I flavor. Can that again? Yeah. Flavor of chicken. And it makes it so much better. Oh, yeah. KFC, KFC is, you know, they're famous for their chicken. Mm-hmm. Yep. For a reason. All right. So, um, we're not the final decider of this. Our moderator, Cookie Monster, uh, is the is the one who will decide. We forgot to rate the other one. Oh, do you want to rate it with the nuggets? Yeah, I'd say it would be five. With the nuggets... Yes, I would give it a five with the nuggets. All right, so we actually don't decide the winner, guys. <laughs> Our moderator, Cookie Monster, is going to tell us what the final what the final rating is. Cookie, have you been listening to the comments? Okay, and whisper my ear what you think it is. Oh yeah, two different ratings for different bowls. That's right. So for the plain smash bowl without the chicken nuggets, we'd rate it a he, Cookie rates it a four. Get it soon. So it's good. You should get it as soon as it comes out, but don't rush. But for the one with the chicken, mm -hmm. Cookie recommends this. This is oh, a yeah. really good. Yeah, as soon as it comes out, like if you hear it's coming out to your local area, if they agree, if they market this across the board, definitely uh, go to your local yeah. KFC as soon as possible and get it. These are both delicious, but you know. This this is a viable option too. It's worth the two dollars. Mm -hmm. Yeah, five whole breast nuggets. Anyway, so um, now we'll see who won from their comment putting in their comments last week. <laughs> and the winner of the game to guess what we'd rate the smashed bowl is Ada Ali eight eight four two. And you win the prize of your own personal proverb. Here's a bag of personal proverbs. Woo. Yes, Flibu, please draw a proverb from the bag of personal proverbs. I have drawn a proverb from the bag of personal proverbs. And it reads, The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. Except in New Jersey, where what's blowing in the wind smells funny.
Ooh, there you go, Ada Ali. That's your personal proverb. Don't smell the wind in New Jersey. You can, no one else can have that. That is yours. Yours forever and ever. Now, uh, if you want to win, uh, ne- I want to win the next time we play. Oh. Do three things. One. One. Like, subscribe, and comment below what you think I'll rate uh, the next food item. Jimmy John's sub, uh, the barbecue ranch crispy chicken. Ooh. Write that in the comments below. That's the first thing. Second thing. Two. Number two. Two. Yes. Hit the bell to turn on notifications so you know when the video is coming. And three. Three. Go to my community page and tell me what videos you want to see. I want to know what content you want to see. Yeah. So fill out those surveys on my community page. Do those three things and you'll be sure to win next week. Oh, yeah. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. Bye.